Welcome to episode 22 of Brick Mania TV. I'm Landon Reimer. And I'm Dan Siskin. All right, what do we got today, Dan? Well, first of all, thanks for a great time for all you people that came and Ooh. saw us in Birmingham, Alabama. We had a great time. Fun. No injuries, no, we didn't lose Landon on the highway. Nothing bad happened. It was <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Nothing bad at all happened. No, no. Uh, we'll be living in <laughs> denial for a while. All right. <laughs> Well, Dan, why don't you take us through this uh, model you have here? Sure. Okay. So this week we have a, a new mini kit. Mm -hmm. uh, we're we're kind of taking a we taking a dial back because, uh, uh, you know, all the preparations for Brick Fair Alabama really wiped us out because mm -hmm. we had such an awesome time. So in the meantime, Yitzi was busy making yep. us a new addition to the uh, workshop. Yep, workshop series. So this is no, kit number five of the workshop series. It's engine hoist. So you've got your little motorized engine hoist. This yep. is one of two that he's made. This is the smaller one. So this Lots would be, of cool little details on this yes, one. Yes, this one has a little engine in it, actually. It comes with a motor. Um, but you basically, you have the engine hoist, have the motor. Um, you know, perfect for your little uh, military workshop. As this engine would be great sticking out a, coming right. out of a Jeep or... A really any era would have one of these, right? Yeah, yeah. This is, I mean, this is, this is you know, it's modern. Cool. Uh, but it would look great on any sort of diorama. Right. Yeah, that's a nice cheap kit. Um, relatively speaking, it's one of the cheaper of the series. And this week, um, we're bringing the drill press, ba right. drill press back. I think it's like batch number five or six. Yeah, it's popular it's kit. Very popular, but we're going to do a special. Mm -hmm. um, you can buy the drill press on its own, or you could, or either one of these on their own for. Uh, um, I think they're uh, eight dollars and eight dollars and fifteen dollars respectively. But if you buy them together this week. Um, as a bundle, you can get them both for 20. 20 bucks. Um, yeah, so if you already have a drill press, sorry, you're out of luck. Um, <laughs> no special for you. There's more than one drill press in your shop. Yeah, yeah, you can give one as a gift. To, you know, <laughs> who wouldn't want a drill cool, press? Cool, cool. I, mean, I would love it. But, you know, if somebody gave me a drill press, I'd be friends with them forever. But like it was, <laughs> I don't have any friends. I had to go buy my own drill press. <laughs> <laughs> you had to buy your own friend sets. I had to buy a drill press, and then I let my friends play with it. So. <laughs> All right. Uh, also, we have a bulk headgear special going on right now. All headgear? Um, all, bri <laughs> all brick arms headgear. And then the Stuart? Yes. It's a kit of the week is what we're calling it. 25% off, which oddly <laughs> enough makes it 12345. That's right. 12345 this week only. So. 25% nice. off the normal price. <laughs> you know, if you're an elite member, that's going to be like closer to 35% off. So cool. third off, um, elite member right there, it almost pays for the membership. It's 50 bucks for a year. Um, we just started a new year, so this is the time to get it. Awesome, awesome. All right, what else we got? Uh, well, it looks like this we have a, yep, a restock of restock the uh, of SDKFZ 250, um, the smaller of the German armored half tracks. Uh, this would be very appropriate for your uh, Barbarossa sort of mm -hmm. dioramas. Um, it has some pretty cool features. It has independent uh, suspension in the front. This pair of sweet uh, Balkenkreuzen uh, printed tiles. Mm -hmm. uh, MG34 with a German Heer soldier, um, which has been one of our most popular minifigs we've done lately. And <laughs> ironically, you can't buy them uh, in the web store because we've used the last of them in the, these right. batches of SDKFC 250s. Of course, they'll be back at some point in the future. We'll let you know when. Cool. All right. So we that. have a we have a BOGO on Dutch infantry, Polish infantry, French infantry, New Zealand infantry, and Australian infantry, and that's out of World War II. Yeah, it's all World War II, and it's one of the more uh, or some of the lesser known, uh, um, yeah. at least for us living in the U.S., where everything's all about America. America. Uh, we don't see too much about these uh, these uh, other battles, and of course, we're important battles of World War Absolutely. II. Absolutely. And in this uh, buy one, get one free, you can build your armies. Mm -hmm. Five, ten decals for the price of five. Um, a good way to good get, a, get ahead. Way cheaper than uh, buying custom printed minifigures. Um, bargain for you. Um, it's cool. Very cool. All right. Uh, anything else, Dan? I don't know. I think the plan is going to do like some tricks for the rest, I of think the, some the rest of the hour. And the well, you said you are going to do some freestyle rapping. So. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just not feeling it today. All right. Thank you for watching episode 22. Yeah, we'll see you next week. Next week. It's the motion picture event that captured a generation. Now, prepare to see it as you've never seen it before. Coming this summer, it's Star Wars Special Edition re-release. It's been four long weeks since the release of Star Wars. Now, new technology is allowing it to be remade as it was meant to be. 
See the movie you love as it was intended to be seen with brand new state-of-the-art visual effects. And the cast you love digitally enhanced beyond all recognition. Oh my goodness, I do not want to be in your movie right now. My name is Lendo. Welcome to Regular City. Darth Ward Special Edition. Coming soon.